Go pick one of the houses. And let's go towards that house. And describe to me what the door looks like. It's a big wooden door. Big wooden door. Okay. Now on the other side of this door is a magical place. It will take you to the past. It will take you to a different place. A place where we're looking for. So I'd like you to open up the door and walk in. And tell me what you see inside. Room. It's a big room. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Describe the room for me. Is it a new room or an old room? It's smooth marble. Smooth marble. Is it on the floor or on the walls? On the floor. On the floor. Mm -hmm. And what color is this marble? It's white with gold in it. White with gold in it. Mm -hmm. And tell me more about this room. What does it look like? There's a light in it. Mm -hmm. There's a light in it. What kind of a light? It's a natural light from the ceiling. Mm -hmm. There's pillows on the floor. Pillows on the floor. Mm -hmm. What color are the pillows? They look like a gold bronzy color. Gold bronzy color pillows. Mm -hmm. Are they big? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What do you think these pillows are used for? To lay and relax. To lay and relax. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What else is in this room? Are there any decorations on the walls? There's sheer curtains everywhere. There's yeah, sheer curtains, uh huh. They blow with the wind. Mm -hmm. They blow with the wind, so the windows are open. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Is there any other furniture in this room? There's some chairs. Mm -hmm. Describe those chairs for me. They're large chairs with a high back. A high back, uh huh. Who would you think these chairs are for? guests that come in. The guests. Mm -hmm. And what would you say this room is used for? Entertaining guests. Mm -hmm. As you look at this room, can you feel yourself that you have a body there? No. Mm -hmm. So how are you observing this room? Are you observing it as spirit? Or do you feel that you are male or female there? Spirit. Spirit. Okay. So as spirit you can now move all around this room. And let's see who lives in this room, who uses it. So I want you to close that scene behind. We're going to open up another scene that will tell us who uses this room. There's more people in there now. So tell me when you see someone using the room.
do you see? See a cat. Mm -hmm. I see a cat. What's the cat doing? Walking. Mm -hmm. Tell me more. Jumped up on a chair. Mm -hmm. Jumped up on a chair. Is this room used for animals or for people? For people. Mm -hmm. so who do you feel uses this room? Just to trust your first impression. A woman. A woman. Mm -hmm. So let's fast forward in this scene until we can see this woman. Tell me what she looks like. She's tall. She's tall. Mm -hmm. Describe her to me. She's wearing a long dress. Mm -hmm. A long dress. What else? She's wearing something on her head. She's wearing something on her head. Is this a hat or a covering of some type? It's a a hat. Mm hmm. What color are her clothing? Light green. Light green. Mm -hmm. Is she young or old? She's about 40. Mm -hmm. Does she have anything in her hands? Is she carrying anything? No. Mm -hmm. So what is this woman doing there? She found the cat. She found the cat. Mm -hmm. She's in the chair and holding it now. So she's sitting in the chair holding the cat. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Is this her cat? Yes. Okay. Tell, tell me more about this woman. What impression do you get from her? She's nice. She's nice? Mm -hmm. what, she, what does she do there in this room? That's her room to think, to be. Mm -hmm. To think and to be? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. It's like a meditation room? Mm-hmm. Okay. And as you look at her, do you see that this woman is of status, of any type of status? Yes. Mm -hmm. Tell me about that. I think people want to be around her. Mm -hmm. People want to be around her. Mm -hmm. Is she some sort of a leader? I think, I don't know. Mm -hmm. All right. So what I'd like you to do is I want you to look into her eyes. Feel yourself looking into your eyes and get closer to this woman. And as your spirit as a spirit, you can get closer and closer to her and find yourself going into her eyes 
And now that you're in her body, you can look out and tell me, what impression do you get? You can feel her emotions. Tell me what you're feeling. emotions you're getting. I feel happy. Mm -hmm. You feel happy? Oh, like I succeeded. Mm -hmm. You succeeded. Mm -hmm. Tell me about that. What did you succeed in? I'm not sure about that. Mm -hmm. You're not sure about that? No. Mm -hmm. So let's find the story of how you succeeded. I want you to take a deep breath in. We're going to go drifting and floating to another time in that same lifetime that will get answers to that. We're drifting and floating to another important scene in that same lifetime. And tell me when you're there. Where are you? Is it daytime or nighttime? It's daytime. Daytime. A lot of people. A lot of people. Mm hmm. Tell me where you are. I feel like, I feel like I'm outside. I'm outside, mm-hmm. A lot of people are gathering around me. A lot of people are gathering around me. Mm-hmm. How are you feeling with all these people? I feel good. Mm hmm What's the occasion? It looks like I just finished speaking. Mm-hmm. I just finished speaking. Mm-hmm. What were you speaking about? Mm-hmm. Well, how is it that you feel about your your speaking? I feel good. Mm-hmm. Do you feel like you're talking on a, on a topic that's important for people? It's important to them. Mm-hmm. Let's see if we could find out what that topic was. Just go into your memory and 
find it there. Trust the first impression that you get. And you can also connect with the people around you telepathically. about kids. Mm -hmm. Something about kids. The children are... The children will have it better than the parents. Mm -hmm. The children will have it better than the parents. Mm -hmm. Are you talking about any type of methods or technology I believe I'm telling them how to to how to get out of the poverty they're in. Mm. So how to get out of the poverty that they're in. Mm -hmm. And how is it that you're telling them? Do you, do you know? What will they need to use to get out of poverty? How to use the earth. Mm -hmm. What will they be getting from the earth? It will grow things. Mm -hmm. that people are damaging the earth. Mm -hmm. People are damaging the earth? Yes. Mm -hmm. So what are you telling them? Everything's put there to help. Mm -hmm. Everything is put there to help. As you're there speaking to these people, what is it that you're wearing? A long, long gown. A long gown. Mm hmm What does it look like? It's white. Mm hmm Very simple. And very simple. Mm -hmm. And tell me, where is it that you're from? Not from there. Mm -hmm. You're not from here. Mm -hmm. How did you get to be where you are? 
on the earth. I was put there. I don't know. You were put there. Mm -hmm. So, are you here to be a spokesperson for Earth? I believe so. Mm -hmm. All right. So, let's find out where it is that you're from. I want you to take a deep breath in, fill your lungs completely, and we're going to be traveling through time and space to find out what it was that, that brought you to this mission. I'm going to see from where you are. Be there now. Look around you. What do you see? clean. Everything is clean. Mm -hmm. Where are you? I'm in the, some type of city. Mm -hmm. What does this city look like? Everything is white. Mm -hmm. Everything is white. What else do you see? I see some kind of plants. Mm -hmm. Like nothing I've ever... I've ever seen before. So you see a plant that you've never seen before? Mm -hmm. Describe that plant for me. It's tall. Tall. Mm -hmm. A lot of spiraling tendrils. Spiraling tendrils. Mm -hmm. Pink flowers. Pink flowers. What does this plant do? Good plant. Mm -hmm. Is it medicinal? I think so. Mm -hmm. So tell me more about the city that you're from. What do you see around you? All the buildings are white. Mm -hmm. Are they modern buildings? Yes. Mm -hmm. What do you imagine they're made from? It looks... Very smooth and white and shiny. Mm -hmm. Smooth, white, and shiny. Do they have windows? They do. Mm -hmm. A lot of windows. A lot of windows. This place where you are, what kind of light does it get? What's the source of the light? Where does it come from? It's still the sun. Mm -hmm. The sun. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Do you see one sun or are there more? I thought I saw more, but I don't know. Mm -hmm. Do you see any? 
other plants or animals besides the white buildings. I just saw a big, something flew. Something flew by? Mm -hmm. Was it big, you said? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Not a bird, but it was big. It was a big bird? Not a bird. Not a bird. Mm -hmm. Do you feel like maybe it was some sort of a vehicle? No, it was a creature. It's a creature. Mm -hmm. Well, you can, you can go back and look back at what it was. Just go backwards a little bit and you'll catch it again. That's a long tail. A long tail, mm-hmm. No feathers. No feathers. Does it have wings? Yes. Mm -hmm. What does the face look like? It resembles a pterodactyl of some kind. Mm -hmm. When you see this creature, do you feel like it's friendly? Yes. Mm -hmm. What else do you see there? Do you see any other beings there? Yes. Mm -hmm. Tell me about them. I see a man. You see a man? Mm -hmm. And a child. And a child. The child comes to me. Mm -hmm. It might be mine. Mm -hmm. Ask him. He's mine. He's yours. How old is he? Three, four. Mm -hmm. You can ask him his name. How do I know it? Mm -hmm. What name do you get? You can spell it if you can't say it. Kai, Kai. Kai? It's Kai. 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 Ask him to spell it for you. Say the letters. K. A. I. L Y N. Like a Kylan? Yes. Mm -hmm. That's your son? Yes. Mm -hmm. How does it feel to be with him again? <laughs> it feels good. Mm -hmm. Give him a big hug. Give him a great big hug. And focus on the man now. Now that you have your son in your arms, focus on him. Tell me what you're feeling from him. I feel 
real good. Mm-hmm. What does he look like? He's tall. Mm-hmm. He has light brown skin. Light brown skin. Mm -hmm. What else? I think he's my partner. He's your partner. Mm -hmm. How was he dressed? A long tunic down to his knees with pants. A long tunic? What color is it? He got a light grayish, silvery gray. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Does he have any adornments on it? No. Mm -hmm. What about your son? How's he dressed? Just the same. Just the same. Yeah. Now look down at yourself and tell me how you're dressed. Just a, a long dress. Mm hmm A long dress. Mm hmm And what color is your skin? I feel like it's light green. Light green. Mm -hmm. Take a look at your fingers. Spread your hands out. I have long, thin fingers. Mm -hmm. Long, thin fingers. Mm -hmm. How many fingers are there? Looks like five. Mm -hmm. And what's the rest of you look like? It's. I still have a feminine structure. Mm -hmm. A feminine structure? Yeah. What does your face look like? I don't know. Mm. Do you have long hair? Short hair? Any hair? It's It's long braided. Long braided hair? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I have gold, gold cuffs on. Gold cuffs. Mm -hmm. What's the significance of these cuffs? I don't know. With a blue stone. With a blue stone. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Do you think that these are just for ornaments, or do they have a different significance of stature? He's wearing one with a blue stone. Mm -hmm. Same thing, same cuffs? Mm-hmm. Okay. All right, so let's find out what it is that you do in this city. 
take a deep breath in. We're going to drift and float to find out what it is that you do together and what your mission is. Tell me where you are. Be there now. Chamber. Mm -hmm. You're in a chamber. What does it look like? But where many different people are. Mm -hmm. um, I'm leading a discussion. You're leading a discussion? Mm -hmm. Who's there with you? Different, different beings from different places. Mm -hmm. Do they look different? Yes. Mm -hmm. Tell me what this meeting is about. Which planet needs help? Mm-hmm. Which planet needs help? Mm-hmm. So tell me what's happening. What's the discussion about? Who is going to go help them? Mm-hmm. Which planet are you discussing? Earth. Mm. Earth needs help. Yes. Mm -hmm. How many people are there with you? How many of these beings? About eight. Eight of you? And they're all different? Some are the same. Mm -hmm. What is this group that you're in? What is your mission there? Submission. To make everybody whole again. Mm. To make everyone whole again. Yes. Mm -hmm. When you say make them whole again, what do you mean by that? Everyone can can work together mm -hmm. from different places in the universe. Mm -hmm. But Earth isn't isn't right. What's happened with Earth? All the abuse. The abuse? What kind of abuse? To the planet? Mm hmm To each other? What's caused that? I don't know. Mm. Have you been sent by someone to help Earth, or is this something that you've decided on your own? I think I decided. Mm -hmm. What is your position there? I definitely. Definitely one of the higher higher 
higher vigils. Elected to elected to do So you were elected to do this? Yes. Mm hmm Who elected you? other individuals from different planets. Mm -hmm. So there's a group from other planets that decide what the missions are? Yes. Mm -hmm. Why has Earth not been part of this? Because they don't get it. They lost it they a lost while it. ago. Mm, what happened? They started fighting amongst each other. Mm -hmm. Greed. Greed. Yes. Mm -hmm. So the greed has kept them from from advancing. Yes. Mm -hmm. Now, is anyone allowed to interfere with her? I was just there. You were just there. Mm -hmm. In what capacity were you there? What were you doing there? was leading the group. Mm -hmm. Did you come as an extraterrestrial? No. How did you come? How did you show yourself? I was one of them. Mm -hmm. Were you born onto them? No. Me? So explain that to me. Tell me what happened. How were you able to to do something like that. I was there for a short time. Only maybe two years. Mm hmm For two years? I think. Mm hmm Did you take on a human body? Yes. How did you do that? went into someone who was sick. Mm -hmm. Were they ready to die? Yes. Mm -hmm. And then what happened? I went, I went and started talking to people. Mm -hmm. So when this person did not die, they recovered with your soul? Yes. Mm -hmm. So they kind of became a hero or heroine? Yes. Mm -hmm. And what happened after the two years? It was my time. My time was up. Mm -hmm. Did someone else come into their body or did they die? No one else. No one else. 
so the person transitioned on their own. Yes. Okay. So what is your plan now with her? I succeeded. Mm -hmm. What changes do you see? I feel the things I said made a difference in being taught to kids no. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, I want you to now take a deep breath in and go to the end of that incarnation. To the last day of the life of that of that being and tell me where you are. Do you see? My son. Mm -hmm. How old is he there? 27. Mm -hmm. How are you feeling? Hurt. Mm -hmm. What happened to you? Something in my abdomen. Mm -hmm. Can you detect, detect what it is? Looks like a weapon. Mm. A weapon? Got you? Yes. Okay. So let's find out how it is that you got there. I want you to go back in time. And let's go back to the moment that caused all of this to happen. Tell me when you're there. Tell me what's happening. Where are you? in that room again mm -hmm. with the leaders what happened we're upset we're upset about about a different mission. Mm hmm Tell me about it. It looks like someone didn't Someone turned. Mm -hmm. Someone turned on the mission. What do they look like? Can you tell? He looks. He's brown, like reptilian looking, though. Mm hmm. He's like a brown reptilian. 
Mm-hmm. Why did he turn on the mission? He knew what he was doing. Mm -hmm. We trusted him. He had a bad intention. What were his intentions? To take down the kingdom. Mm -hmm. Which kingdom is this? Mine. Mm -hmm. Does it go by a name? I can't see. Mm -hmm. It's okay. So this reptilian turned against the kingdom? Yes. Is he from your kingdom? No. Okay, he's from somewhere else? Yes. Mm -hmm. So what is he doing? He's the one who hurts me. Mm -hmm. What does he use against you? Something made of metal. Mm -hmm. it, it's very intricate, very, very pretty, almost. Mm -hmm. Does he stab you with this? Yes. Does he do this to anybody else? Or just you? No. Are you the leader? Yes. Okay. Now, let's go forward now to the last moment of your life there. Before you transition. And I want you to tell me, what are the thoughts that are going through your mind? my son to finish finish what I was starting mm -hmm. to help her all of my missions mm -hmm. breath now and tell me what happens as you leave that body it went dark but now I'm above and I can see mm-hmm Now, from that perspective, you can look back at your life and tell me what lessons did you learn from it? I learned how to lead. Mm -hmm. And what do you think that the purpose was of that lifetime? It was something with trust. Mm -hmm. Something with trust. Yes. Mm -hmm. Now, from, from your perspective, you can see all of the different lifetimes that you've ever lived. And there's a lifetime now with a woman named Christy. Can you tell me what influence you have on her from your lifetime? What 
is she getting from you? Is she picking up on any of your sadness? Yes. Mm -hmm. How can you help heal that? What would you like to tell her about that? Trust. Do you have anything else to tell her at this time? To help her out with her life and her mission? See it. What did you say? I don't see. Welcome back. What happened? Mm -hmm. What happened? I feel hot. Mm -hmm. I just feel hot. Let's take the blanket off. Did you feel a power surge of heat? Yes. <coughs> That's great. <coughs> Do you need to use the bathroom? Um, I don't know, I might need to. Okay. So just close your eyes. And let me count you out properly. So you can space it out. I'm going to count from one to five. And when I get to five, you do one. Thank you.